hey guys, hey, look at this right here. This is Extensify. This is a tweak store for non-jailbroken iPhones. It runs on iOS 9. Yes, I'm running iOS 9 right here, and I have a tweak store that will allow me to tweak the apps on my non-jailbroken iPhone. This is iOS 9. First of all though, thumbs up if you really are excited about this, because I am. Leave me a thumbs up down below and let me know. Now, let's look at Extensify, because that's the name of this application that allows you to run tweaks on a non-jailbroken iPhone. In fact, I have a tweak for Vine already installed on my non-jailbroken iOS 9 device. So let's head over to the springboard here. I'm gonna swipe over, we're gonna find Vine. It's in the social folder, there we go. All right, so you see two Vine apps here, Normal Vine and Vine Plus. Vine Plus is of course the tweaked version of Vine, and what Vine Plus allows you to do is to save videos from Vine directly to your camera roll. Obviously, you cannot do that normally with stock Vine. So this tweak called Vine Plus allows me to save videos from Vine to my camera roll on a non-jailbroken device. So that means I can do really cool things like this. I'm gonna tap the little ellipsis button, tap save, and now I can save Vine videos directly to my camera roll. Pretty cool, you can't do that with stock Vine. So you guys are probably wondering, what does this app look like? How does it work? Well, let me just explain something first. This is not a replacement for Cydia. Cydia tweaks can modify stock portions of iOS. For instance, turning the control center dark or modifying stock applications or springboard elements, etc. Extensify, on the other hand, is for modifying apps that you can download from the App Store. So let's walk through the interface here. At the top, you have a featured section. If you tap on the featured item, you can view details on that item. And you have a list of the top tweaks, which are also called Exos in Extensify. Now let's tap the catalog tab, and inside the catalog tab, you'll find a listing of all of the various tweaks or exos available. So that means you can tap all apps and view a listing of all the exos available, or tap an individual app, and you can view all the exos available for that particular app. And when you tap on an exo, you get a very App Store-esque details page that gives you a description of the exo and what it does, gives you screenshots, uh, gives you information like latest version, download, size, you can contact the author directly from here. You can see a change log, you see what's new right there. And of course you have that description. And then you can also comment. So if you tap the little comment button in the upper right hand corner, you can comment via Discuss, Facebook, Twitter, Google, um, and let people know how good or how bad the XO is. So now let's install Twitter Plus. I'm gonna tap Get, and that's gonna prepare it and then below you'll see a build session tab, which is very much like the mini player in the music app for iOS 8.4. And that allows you to get to the build section of Extensify from anywhere within the application. So I'm gonna tap it here. And then you'll see app selection, which allows you to select an application to attach Exos to. And then you'll also see Exo selection. You can select the Exos that you would like to use. So I have plus selected there, and then I'm just gonna tap on build and it starts the build process. Now watch this very carefully, this is important. So it downloads a new version of the app from the App Store. Uh, so it's downloading a new copy of Twitter and basically it's combining it with the tweak or XO. So basically you're getting a whole new version of Twitter with the tweak applied. So if you already have Twitter installed, you'll actually have two copies of Twitter instead of just one. So now it's all combined, everything's ready to go, ready for deployment. So all you do is tap install now and then you're gonna tap install, and then you're gonna see it appear on your home screen like that. So I'm gonna speed this portion up just a little bit so we can get through the installation. And like I said, this is a brand new app. You still see the original version of Twitter on my home screen. So basically you have two Twitter apps now, the tweaked version and the original version. Now tweaked applications will have a plus sign after them. So in this case, Twitter plus. Makes sense, right? So let's go ahead and fire up Twitter Plus. We're gonna log into Twitter and then I'm gonna show you the tweaks embedded in the Twitter app now. No jailbreak, remember this, no jailbreak and we're able to tweak applications. All right, so I'm gonna to go to the Profiles tab then I'm gonna tap the little Preferences button there. And now, see that? Plus configuration, so that is Twitter Plus plus configuration that normally doesn't appear in the Twitter app. Now you have all these options here. Native Instagram viewer, view block profiles, hide the follow button, confirm favorites, longer DM. And remember, this is just the tip of the iceberg, ladies and gentlemen. What people are gonna be able to do with this, what developers are gonna be able to do with this is really 
uh, gonna be interesting to see. So now I have the confirm button whenever I tap the favorite. Uh, so that's just one example, one small example of the various tweaks that could be possible with Extensify. So here's the original version of Twitter just for comparison so you guys can see. Actually, let me go ahead and open that up and tap the profile button in the settings. You'll see that that Twitter Plus option is no longer there. Now, of course, Extensify allows you to go in and manage all the exos that you have downloaded to your device here. Under the My Exos tab, you'll see a listing of all the exos you have installed. And of course, you can go through one by one and manage those individually. So if you tap on one, you can either delete it or choose to install it if you haven't already. So I'm gonna just delete all of these different exos and notice that when you delete an exo, it doesn't uninstall the app. If you wanna uninstall a tweaked app, all you do is just uninstall it like you normally do by tapping and holding, going to wiggle mode and tapping the X button. So you can see I have all the exos removed, but the Twitter plus app is still there. And if I wanna remove that, I would just tap and hold on it, go into wiggle mode, tap the X button. So ladies and gentlemen, yes, you can tweak apps on a non-jailbroken device. You can tweak apps on iOS 9. Extensify allows you to do that. It's still in development. There's still lots of changes that the developers plan on making, but the core product is there and it works. Tweaks on a non-jailbroken device, pretty awesome. Folks, let me know what you guys think about Extensify down below in the comment section. If you appreciated this video walkthrough, please leave me a like and make sure you subscribe because there's more coming soon. Let me know what you think in the comment section. This is Jeff with iDownloadBlog.